How's it going, Hardwood Nation? I'm your online host, Billy Hartman, and joining me tonight is Lucas Woodman to talk about this Nussville York versus Wellston game. The Lady Buckeyes, they were able to win their second game of the season tonight, beating the Lady Rockets 65-51. to Now the, Buc the Lady Buckeyes have not played a game in over a week, but it did not show tonight. Well, the Lady Buckeyes definitely wanted this one. They told us in the offseason that they were definitely prepared for this game. They said that they wanted to make up for their two losses against them last year, and it definitely showed tonight. Wellston came into the game. They were very physical. They had the height advantage, but NY responded, and they definitely played smart tonight. They slowed down their offense, and they got the looks that they wanted, and they didn't force any shots. Wellston had free throw trouble in, towards the end of the first half. They only ended up shooting 50% to NY's 81%, so that was a huge huge deciding factor in the game. NY played a tremendous D throughout. Jenna Addis and Brooke Breeze definitely had a lot of hustle points. Brooke Breeze had three blocks on one possession at one point and that definitely got the crowd and the team going. Jenna Addis, of course, with her uh, perimeter defense definitely helps them out. Sammy Oosley had 22 points tonight. Definitely a struggle for Shelby True and Madison Davis, Davis to guard her. She was definitely a tall uh, person for them tonight. Uh, Angela Mead did control the offense though for the Lady Buckeyes, contributing 17 points. Shelby True also helped out there and had a lot of rebounds. And Brooke Breeze had another, for the second straight game, had a great performance. And the girls definitely wanted this win and they came out and they got it tonight, 65 to 51. The Lady Buckeyes, they had this game circled on their schedule. How big was this win for them tonight? Well, they were definitely ready for this game after talking to Coach Dalton and Angela Mead after the game. They said that this was a sigh of relief and they were ready to move forward after this game. And they were really excited to uh, start the season off 2-0. Oh, it was so important. We thought about it all week. We haven't had a game since like last Thursday or last Monday or something like that. And that's all we've been thinking about it. Every time we come to the gym, it's Wilson, Wilson. What are we going to do to stop them? And we did today. So it was very important to us. Lucas, the Lady Buckeyes had three players in double figures tonight, and it looks like their offense is really clicking at this point in the season. Absolutely. Angela Mead with 17 points tonight, Shelby True with 15, and Brooke Breeze having 10 after her stellar performance in the first game when she had 20. It's definitely looking good for them. Uh, they like to pass the ball well, not too many turnovers, and it's going to be a bright future for them, and it's great to see what they can do on Monday against Alexander. Well, hopefully this Lady Buckeyes offense can stay hot as they continue to uh, stay undefeated. Thanks a lot, Lucas. Remember to join host Graham Fugazi and the rest of the Hardwood Heroes crew on Sunday, January 13th at 11.30 p.m. on WOUB. But until then, don't worry. You can check us out on the web at woub.org slash heroes, as well as like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter at Hardwood Heroes. For Lucas Woodman, I'm Billy Hartman reminding you to be heroic.